an energized start to Angela Merkel's re-election campaign. After eight years at the helm of Europe's biggest economy, she's still the country's most popular politician, packing out the medieval town square of Seligenstadt near Frankfurt. The economy is likely to be at the heart of this election, along with labor policies and European integration. What we're not arguing about in Europe, and we should never forget this, is that we live together in freedom. We have freedom of travel, freedom of speech, freedom of faith. Look at the burning churches in Egypt. We can be proud in Europe that we share all this freedom together. The Chancellor is widely expected to win a third term. Recent polls show her Conservatives hold a comfortable lead over their main rival, the Social Democrats. But she'll still have to form a coalition. And if Mrs Merkel's current partner, the Free Democrats, don't get enough votes, she could be forced into tricky negotiations with this man, Per Steinbrück, who leads the centre-left Social Democrats. The campaign will heat up on September the 1st, when Mrs Merkel and Mr Steinbrück have their only televised duel. That comes three weeks ahead of the final ballot. Emily Thomas, BBC News.